Good evening, my name is David Lane. I'm out here with Zachary Rose. Today's date is January 26, 2019, and I'm about to perform a video inspection of the main line of 117 West Augusta Avenue here in Spokane, Washington. Um, one of our co-workers was out here um, yesterday and um, found that the main line needed to be jetted. Um, we got here this evening and uh, just performed a jetter. The jetter comes with a video inspection. And what we're looking at right now is the very end of the main line. Now as I push forward, we're going to actually go vertically um, up and down, uh, vertically down into the sewer. And you can see the water pooling off the end of my camera here. But as we drop in, that's actually the sewer right there. We can, you can just see glimpses of it when, the, when, we, get, when we shake that water off. That's something that we're not really going to be able to um, get, a visual on. get a good visual on. But this is the Spokane City sewer going straight down into it. There's a good picture of it right there. Right there. And as we pull back, you'll always be able to tell where the bottom of the pipe is um, by where the little bits of water are, kind of to the right hand side there, and by where my camera light is. Now what we're pulling into, what looks like to me, 4 inch clay towel pipe, the most problematic areas for clay towel pipe are the joints. Just over time the ground settles and the joints tend to offset and separate. Um, that's where roots normally grow in. On this pipe, however, we're finding um, that the roots are actually growing through the side of the pipe where there's a hole. Um, and this was also a... Um, a uh, uh, thing of note is right here we we go into water we drop down from the clay towel pipe into some green PVC and you can see the offset over time the ground has settled there's a good you can see the surface of the water we're actually underwater right here our camera lens is an inch and a half thick and we have a ball on our lens so this water is about two inches deep and it's due to this PVC pipe losing grade and shifting. So you're always going to have water standing there, and that's a, you know, a good uh, cause for backups. Our solids accumulate there and can cause a sludge blockage. And you can see this back end, how at the top of the pipe it's shifted. But you will uh, note the roots going through the side of the pipe as soon as we get there bottom of the pipe is in on the left hand side of the screen here just passing 29 feet from the city sewer the rest of the pipe looks really good it's I do believe it's an older pipe just due to the stress fractures and the actual deterioration of the of the pipe itself and it's a very long main line we're talking 100 and 125, 130 feet long to the city sewer. Had a little bit of roots there. We what we did was we just put the jetter in there and went section by section. This was a section that we had to only make one pass on due to the. That's actually a rock right there that you see at the top of the pipe and you see the the cracks and breaking of the of the clay tile um, it's kind of just a matter of time before that you know falls in that root was all, all the way thick all the way through the pipe we were able to clean it up with a pass so but we just opted to stay off of it after that after we saw um, the deterioration of the pipe You can see how that crack was kind of originating from that rock. Probably the ground settled over time and that rock just pinholed the top of it, you know. And then it cracked around it. And then that's a perfect pathway for roots. Just passing 70 feet from the city sewer. Pulling back towards the home. Other than that PVC pipe, we got really 
really nice grade. We don't see a lot of standing water here. Here's the other one. This was a really bad one. We uh, cleaned it up as best we could, but like like I said again, um, you can see the the cracks there going down the pipe and concentrated right where that root's growing in. Other than those two spots in the pipe, the pipe stack and the the grade loss at the PVC repair. Other than those three spots, the pipe actually for as old as it is looking all right. Here we transition from clay towel pipe into cast iron. Cast iron normally stubs out from the house three to five feet. Here we're coming up out of the clean out now. And there's the clean out we're working out of. Again, my name is David Lane. I'm I'm out here with Zachary Rose. We're with Bulldog Rooter. Today's date January 26, 2019. And that will conclude the video inspection of the main line of 117 West Augusta Avenue here in Spokane, Washington. Thank you very much for choosing Bulldog Rooter.